Well, good evening guys. Did you miss me? Uh, I left you without content for quite a while, so I thought maybe it's a good time to get back into making those late night videos, which I enjoy really, really much. And I'll be doing more of those uh, coming up, you know, and uh, other videos that um, I have scheduled and some that just have in my mind. Uh, this is one of those rare occasions that you will see me play on an emulator rather than the real thing and that's why uh, and that's because I don't really have any other choice. This is a ROM hack that we're gonna play so I can't I don't have a physical copy of that. Uh, the only ROM hack I do have a physical copy of and you know of it uh, it's uh, a Mortal Kombat 2 Unlimited um, and wow this is a great ROM hack uh, suggested to me by my dear friend Pixel Seas. I'll leave the link to his channel down there in the description. If I deserve so many views and over 300 subscribers, so does he and he actually deserves even more than me. Uh, so go ahead and watch his videos. He has that great 80s vibe in his channel. I love his videos. And he does these little things. He does, he does play those ROM hacks and I find those very interesting. I even see, I have even seen, I have witnessed uh, one in one of his videos him playing a ROM hack of the Super Nintendo uh, Mortal Kombat, Super Nintendo port of Mortal Kombat having blood. So yeah, really cool stuff. But the one we're gonna be playing today is called uh, Mortal Kombat uh, Champion Edition. It's uh, a ROM hack of the Super Nintendo port. And we're gonna be playing that because in this one you can actually play as Reptile. So before I begin, I should say that, well, okay. if you're going to play this uh, on emulation, uh, which is probably what you're going to do uh, if you want to play this ROM hack, emulation on PC on this game is not good, okay? Windows emulators, I didn't enjoy any of those that I've tried. I, I will try playing this on the closest one, uh, the closest it can be on the or to the original uh, it, it's weird, like the gameplay, the controls, I tried three different emulators, uh, there was two that I already had installed in my, on my PC, one of them was SNES 9X and ZSNES, ZSNES I've been using for quite a while since I had a laptop that didn't have the CPU strength to keep going so I didn't want to stress it and I had that uh, emulator that's actually a pretty decent choice for someone that doesn't have a high-end PC uh, you can pretty much emulate it's compatible with most of the ROMs I know of and you can actually play there without stressing your PC too much. SNES 9X is a little bit more accurate and it does need your CPU to be a little bit you know not not too much but a little bit stronger um, but none of these two, actually ZSNES was not even recommended on this ROM hack, but none of these two uh, were compatible with, you know, well, SNES 9X was compatible, but it was bad. Both of these were really bad in terms of gameplay. I just could, couldn't put my finger on it. There was this huge delay when I, when I, when I gently tapped my uh, D-pad, uh, my character wouldn't even move, wouldn't, wouldn't even budge. And I, I never remembered uh, the SNES version of Mortal Kombat being that bad. I mean, comparable, if you're trying to compare it with a, the with a Mega Drive version or the Genesis version, I get it. But no, it wasn't that bad. So I'm like, what's wrong why can't i play this so i went on to play on the original hardware which is like seriously two feet away from me right now and i smashed the game uh i breezed through it on one continue and safe to say that i can't do that on, on snes 9x i have downloaded another emulator that's smoother but again not so smooth uh, BeastNess, and I'm gonna be playing it on there, but my safe assumption is that if you see all these YouTube videos giving hate 
to uh, the Super Nintendo version of Mortal Kombat, it's probably because it's been played on bad emulation. I have even witnessed YouTube videos comparing Super Nintendo vs Mega Drive and I'm pretty sure the emulation on the Super Nintendo one was Zed SNES because the sound Johnny emulation Cage. was pretty bad and this is what I witnessed when, while trying to play that on Zed SNES. Uh, so mind blowing, my guess is that probably Pixel uh, sees uses RetroArch since he's playing it on his Genesis Mini. But I won't be doing that, I'm gonna be playing on PC so that I can be able to record this a little bit easier. Um, yeah, my guess is probably do it on RetroArch if you have a SNES Mini or something like that. I, I think there is a RetroArch that you can actually install on your PC. Try RetroArch. I don't know, I didn't have so much time to see if RetroArch also works. So we're gonna be playing uh, not through the entirety of the game. I'm gonna be playing as much as I can go without losing. So, you can play as Reptile in this game. What you need to do is hold down select. Yeah, this is the one that I've been put And press any button. How do you know it worked? You know, uh, the cursor automatically went on to choose Scorpion. The sprite that you watched was still Sub-Zero. Uh, the announcer said Scorpion, but no. What you have... It's Reptile. So let's get on with the game. Let's see how it works. Reptile has the uh, both the move list, both the move set of Sub Zero and Scorpion. Yeah, I don't feel so comfortable right now because I have so many. I have something in front of me just to keep my. Uh, yeah, the Beast Nest one is a lot smoother. Like I can't uh, be making uh, so many spears with minimum uh, minimum effort. And just pretend that it's not better. It's actually better. It's actually better. It's working better. It's working better for me, but you know, still, it's not as smooth as the real thing. It's not as smooth as the real Super Nintendo. Of course, why would I expect something like that? I don't know. Because like, I'm not used to playing in original hardware, maybe. Maybe I'm expecting too much. So, he has uh, all the moves that Sub-Zero has, has and Scorpion has. Both of, of their fatalities, which I thought is really impressive. And yeah, you should try that. But if you do try that, just keep in mind. Just keep in mind, you know, maybe probably Retroarch, not even Beastness, like I'm doing right now. And yeah, I'm talking, I'm barely looking at, but I'm mostly looking at my face because I have OBS opened up. But yeah, I'm that good. Come on. Yeah, bullshit. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty early in the game, it's probably gonna get hooked on my spear. Yeah, I know, I, I am tedious, but it's late at night. I've already had too much trouble trying to figure out which simulator I should be using, so yeah, didn't have much time to. Oh, it didn't work. Why? I wonder why. And let's see. There's a weird glitch on that emulator that if you lose one round, sometimes it resets your entire score. It didn't happen now. But if it does happen, you'll be able to tell. Lucan can be a handful later rounds. Trying to, to do this really cool thing that I did the other day. Real point of just hold down and move around, but uh, we have to be close to the core. Uh, next up, we're gonna be doing the, the Sub Zero Fatality. Even though uh, it doesn't even look like ice <laughs> sometimes. But you'll see, you know, if I get to do it, you'll see. Next up, Sonia. A really fun ROM pack, you know, if you have a SNES Mini or a Genesis Mini or anything like that, I suggest you go ahead and download that. 
and we'll be doing more of those. We'll be checking out more of those. Now, there is that strategy that I should be really using, but I'm not doing that so far. It's how Michael taught me to play this game, but I'm not listening that much. You know, I'm kind of stubborn. It, it's... It's a pretty easy way, oh my god, you know, I don't feel comfortable, yeah, maybe like that. So you do this roundhouse, if you duck, you just force the opponent to do that, so you keep that in mind. Just in case you wanna escape, that's pretty good. Duck. Oh my god, I forgot. I'm so automated in this idea that this is Scorpion. He's not Scorpion, he's a reptile. Well, he basically is Scorpion. I haven't even used the slide move, which is by far the most... Uh, that shit. Ah, I failed. Who cares? Oh. Next up, we have... Yeah, I promised. Next up is gonna be... Sub Zero's fatality, so. Uh oh. I'm too close. I'm too close. Oh, I gotcha. I gotcha. I gotcha. You sucker. That was easy. Yeah, on Beast Nest, it, it's. It plays much smoother. You know, it's not perfect, but it's smoother. Like, I was so surprised at how badly those other emulators played. Yeah, let's do the thing. Have a nice roll to me, Cage. Just chilling down there without any blood, without anything. How much better would this game be? It would have blown our minds if, you know, the Super Nintendo was a powerhouse, you know. You can you can tell how good the colors are. Like, it, it looks like a miniature kid. And the sound, the sound is amazing. Holy crap, Kano beat my ass over there. Yeah, Mortal Kombat Champion Edition, you can play as Reptile. If we had this back in the day, we would be stoked. Ugh, why? Yeah, my turn. My turn. Ah, keep doing that. Gotcha. I almost lost there. Again, it's gonna be a one is game over, it's game over. I either do it one shot or not. We're probably not gonna do it one shot. Once I get to the endurance matches, it's gonna be probably the end. But I, I don't even see myself going to the endurance matches for this. I mean, look at Kato. Oh, see? The slide there. To save my gameplay. You know, at least now it's bearable. Like, yeah. The real deal is, like, beat it, no continues. Tough luck, if you're me right now, but it is what it is. Raiden. Let me have Michael's strength so that I can do it. What? What the shit did you do just now, Raiden? Holy shit. There's always something new in this game, I swear to God. I did as fast as I could. 
Holy crap. It is what it is. Oh, are you going to play like that? Are we doing this? There we go. I have a few cheat codes on my own. Oh. Oh my god. I just tried to fight back. I couldn't. So, guys, that is Mortal Kombat Champion Edition. Uh, you can play as Reptile, Sang Tsung, and Goro in this one. Uh, and the way you um, choose this guy, these guys from the roster, you uh, go on Sub Zero's uh, tile on the character select screen. You just hold select there and press any button, you get to select Reptile. You do the same procedure, I think, trying to choose Liu Kang and uh, Johnny Cage? Yeah, probably. You know, if I'm wrong, you know, the, the if you download the ROM hack, uh, it says there in the description exactly what you need to do. It, it's up there. So, yeah, that is Mortal Kombat Champion Edition. You can actually play as Reptile in this. Who cares about Sang Tsung and, and uh, Goro? Come on, man. Uh, play as Reptile. Johnny both uh, fatalities there, both both move sets. Even though I didn't get to show some sort of fatality. Uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this. As for me, I'll see you next time. Thanks, guys, for watching. Have a good one. Good night.